we are playing the current household and we are with the Riley family and this is actually Audrey's family. So Audrey is the first born of the Riley, which is my himself. But anyway, she's just finished university and now she's moved into her own place with her man, Jim. And they've now moved into this lovely three bedroom house. So it's a nice little small house for them and it's really cute. I really like the house. I decorated up the house myself, but the house is originally from Tumblr. So yeah, so I decorated myself, it was really cute. I really like the layout of the house. And plus we adopted back our cat, Cindy. The cat that we had in the first generation, which was Mary's actual first cat. And uh, we just thought we'll give her the best life before she dies. She was not meant to be a mum and she never really liked her kittens. So we gave them away in the first generation. So that's what happened. And that's why she's now a lone cat. I don't know what even happened last time I played this family. I think last time we played family, um, Jim just moved in. Uh, let me see if she's pregnant. So she could be, no, she ain't pregnant. So so that's that's it literally that's what happened is that Jim moved in that's really it Cindy's actually pretty well trained as you can tell she just sits there in her own little castle money her own business you know just doing her own thing so she is pretty happy and content with life uh, she does her own thing whenever she wants so yeah it's all right and Audrey's now just got up oh she's finished sleeping okay she doesn't really need anything for promotion she's done everything that she needs and yeah she's pretty much set she needs to keep in contact with her sisters which is Renee Jada so Audrey needs to actually you know what does Audrey Cindy have much chemistry anymore oh they don't oh they don't have much chemistry anymore okay so I'm gonna get Audrey to come and play with Cindy a little bit do you need anything no little tray everything's all full come here and praise for playfulness give some love I don't know if she'll let her stroke her but probably not this is so cute the way she shakes and the bell goes it's so it's so cute can I play finger wiggle with her oh she does not like okay she does not like the tr the stroking okay Okay, Cindy is not a fan of us and we need to give her her own space. She is hard to love. She's a very hard to love kind of cat, okay? You know what, let's just work at home. I don't care. Let's do mechanical, please. You know what? Yeah, I actually enjoy live streaming and then having the play it back like watching you guys comments in the chat and like your responses i love it i li literally live for it and i love it but the only problem is that the streams take me hours to edit because it's like two hours of footage to edit and i have to edit out the things that are irrelevant up to the funny bits about the actual video and it's just it's hard and it's just like i have two videos which are like four hours long all together and it's just it's so hard to edit my brain is just burning <laughs> Oh my, okay, you know what? This is where we stop. So Jim and Audrey are out here doing the most on the sofa. Like, a try for baby. They're having a cuddle. Kiss romantically. You know what? These lot, they just, okay, they're having a woohoo, but uh, Lord Jesus Christ. Like I didn't even, okay, this is where we stop. The thing is, I would love someone to edit for me, but for me, I'm pretty OCD on how I edit. I have a particular style that I go for and I can't find it when someone else will edit for me. So I like to do it myself because I know exactly what I'm looking for. And if something has gone wrong, it will piss me off. So I like to do it myself. But anyway, these lot just finished woohooing. I don't know. <laughs> oh, sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> They're just out here doing the absolute most. And you know what? I'm here for it. I'm actually low key, but very high key. But also really low key here for it. <laughs> I need to stop saying low key and high key because everyone's like, that's a lot of low key and high keys. I was like, yeah, bitch. Like, that's me. Okay, and here comes a cat just running around as if it's nothing. Doing the absolute most. What's she doing? What is she doing? She's playing with the flies. Okay, I don't know what she's doing with her life, but I'm gonna go ahead and pray. Oh, no, I can't, okay. She's out here just chasing her tail. I don't know how you can take a cat for a walk, but let's take a cat for a walk. There's a couple for Cindy in an hour. Cindy has a job required for promotion rollover. I'm weak, Cindy out here with a whole job. I'm so done, okay, you know what? Let's teach, teach her to roll over then. Uh, command, teach command, roll over. You're just jealous because you have no hairline, micro penis, dick, dick energy. I'm weak, favor. How could you insult me like that? Like, I said we're friends. Like, I do have a hairline, bitch. Fuck you. I seen you in your dusty weave. Don't chat to me about no hairline having herself. Go by. Got me all the way fucked up. Roll the hell over. What's wrong with you, Cindy? Does Cindy have any vacation days? No, she doesn't. So she, Cindy has to go to work. Well, that's kind of sad. <laughs> Let's stop that then. I'm telling you what last name is. This is just like generic. <gasps> that dog is beautiful. Ooh. Okay, Tiffany, get, get your white ass off. A dog is a beautiful breed. I want Tiffany. Yo, I actually want Tiffany. Tiffany is cute. Aw. Oh, look at Tiffany. She looks mad cute. Dogs of Sims 2 are just so cute. I love it. I actually love the way they look. They look amazing. 
Our maid is kind of hot though. But you know what? Jim is a very nice guy. So we're not gonna be fornicating with any other girls out here in the streets because Jim is a hard worker. Actually, no. He's a popularity aspiration. This is not good. <laughs> this is not good. Okay, this is where we have trouble. I've just realized in this house that I have plants next to each other, which is so weird. Anyway, Audrey orders her digital star fleet to blockade her opponent's planet, whatever, whatever. Unique planetary orbit allows Audrey two choices of her invasion. She can attempt the stealthy approach by navigating the... Oh my god. Okay, this is just long. I really don't care. I'll go with planetary assault. I don't, I don't, I really don't care. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Also approaching the shield. The opponent offers light resistance at first. She launched a massive group of fighters at Audrey's fleet. But honey, okay, whatever. Battle concludes swiftly with the defenders losing only a few strike fighters. Um, and Audrey is forced to withdraw in shame. She costs her 11,000 simoleons. Really? For a freaking game? 11,000 simoleons? You know what? This is when I tell you I'm done. People ain't shit. So we out here just lost 11k and now the cat is about to have a promotion. The cat is getting a promotion. Like, do you see this? The cat is getting a promotion. I'm so done. On the set of Fluffy, the rodent chaser, which is actually the name of one of her kids. Um, Cindy observes two men delivering flowers. How does the cat? To the trailer of Felicia's Purse, the start of the show, before they leave the hat, the flowers, they sprinkle a substance that can be can only be catnip on the plant. It's probably, you know, Felicia has a low tolerance on for the herb and has previously had, had to cancel several movies due to exhaustion resulting from catnip frenzy. If Felicia has whatever gets these flowers, they she will surely eat the catnip and will be unable to perform. Cindy is the understudy. So she warned Felicia's and looked the other way in hopes of getting the part. That's mad evil. You know what? Warn her because you ain't that evil. Anyway, after the villains depart the scene, Cindy runs to security and alerts them. How does a cat... How? Please tell me, how does a cat tell security that there's catnip in the flowers? Unless security are cats too. Like, how... Anyway, alerts them to the presence of catnip on the flowers through a well-timed series of meows and scratches. I am weak. Then Cindy manages to pick up the villain's scent and leads the security team to their vehicle parked in the back. A whole dog. Felicia's is so grateful for saving her from the catnip that she promotes Cindy to stunt double for her upcoming film, Aquatic Basin Cat. The, you know what? Sims 2... I swear, whoever was working writing up these little promotion cards was high. Because I'm done. I'm so done. <laughs> I can't. This is just too much. I have never seen such bull hickory in my life. Like, it's just a lot. All hot footballers can have my children except Wayne Rooney because my children will be looking like Lego bricks. I'm so weak. Wayne Rooney is, is wearing a whole weave. Like, he actually has a whole weave. Anyway, Cindy's just got promoted to a stunt double and she is home after a hard day of work of meowing and eating her own shit. I'm so done. I am so done. Like, how is this possible? I'm just beyond done. I thought it was obvious that Hot Footballers don't, <laughs> doesn't include Wayne Rooney. Y'all are rude as shit. Y'all are actually so rude. I am done. How could y'all? I'm so finished, you man. Y'all too much. This cat is mad talented, right? Like, I don't understand how a cat can get a promotion. Like, I, I don't get it. A whole cat meowing to security guard to tell him, like, look, this thing has catnip. Girl, like, can you, like, take it out? And then, like, a whole dog trailing them to the people who did it. Sophie, okay, like, like what, what is this? I'm so done. This game just makes me laugh. Like, I can't. Like, how is this possible? Anyway, uh, I think Audrey should be home in about three, three hours. Oh, God, long. Let's speed this up, my babes. So, Audrey got deducted by 11K and actually bought her 1,250,000. ,000. Like, anyway, uh, she's been promoted to the guild leader level 9, 2 to 9 p.m. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday, 1,250 small into a day. Let's go ahead and take it. But she still got deducted by 11,000. That's just too much money. Like, we out here being broke. Okay, I'm gonna get um, Jim up to actually teach this cat to do something because this cat needs promotions, apparently. And um, she needs to roll over and play dead. Oh my god. Okay. Let's go ahead and praise for not scratching furniture. Yeah, it looks like Cindy does not like Audrey at all. But I don't think she even liked Audrey when she was a child, when Cindy was around anyway. So that doesn't exactly help. But oh well. 
But I need to teach Cindy to roll over. Neri Carr is still in our house trying to steal our stuff. Neri Carr, find a space for yourself. He keeps coming to our house. What the hell is he doing? The way he walks is like someone who just has poo in his bum constantly. Like, what are you looking for exactly, my friend? Jim, I'm going to need you to actually work out. You know what? Work on the computer a little bit. Should we get like a boxing thing in the garden? Because we need something like that. There's one for... No, it's not in here. It's the uh, actual rewards. Yeah, there is actual rewards. All right, let's go ahead and buy one then. Okay, Audrey has finished what she's doing and she needs creativity and more logic. Oh, yeah, she needs everything in her life. Why is this me? Okay, let's go work at home and we're going to do... Let's do that logic. Oh, I did cooking. My bad. My bad, girl. Let's do logic and finish that one off so we can work more on the create on what what's the other one on the oh yeah we need to oh sh we need to do mechanical too uh-uh oh so jim has become really fit now is he average or is he actually like proper fit oh he's actually proper fit okay he really smells though he's smelling himself all right come on take a shower please and let's go and serve breakfast okay let's have some strawberry oatmeal oh you know what yeah i've actually had strawberry oatmeal before it tastes okay but it's a bit of sweet kind of taste so it's like the oatmeal is just savory and is bland and then the strawberries cast like a little bit of a bit of taste but it's sweet at the same time so it's like it's not really that nice compared to having banana or something so i just yeah the reason why i did that was actually because my strawberries were about to expire so i thought let me just use up the strawberries while i can and i did and it's just like yeah that bathtub is dirty ew look at the stains i'm weak why are you why are you yowling for you know what i, I don't want to clean the shower but i know we need to but we've got a maid for that so i can't be bothered oh jim does jim have green eyes Oh yeah, it's because he's an NPC. I keep forgetting he's an NPC. Are they actually married? <gasps> They're engaged. They're not actually married yet. Oh, really? You out here burning oatmeal? Really? All the oatmeals? Come on, Jim. Baby boy, please. You know, oh, that oatmeal looks kind of crusty as well. Oh God, let's not do that again. Okay, let's try cook cook and munchies. It's just a simple cereal. Let's just do that. You can't burn cereal. All right, she, he wants to throw a wedding party, which I want to lock in because I need him to do that anyway. And yeah, so we're going to do that. I don't know, which we, who should we invite? I think it's going to be Audrey that will host it because Audrey has more friends, I think. I'm not even sure. Do we have funds for a wedding party? We have 6,000 smallions. Oh, his carpool. Oh my God, I forgot his carpool is that. That's so cool. That's actually so cool. Completely forgot about that, you know. Okay, Jim, you need to go to work. I'll let Jim go to work and then I will see if we can have the wedding party when he gets home because Audrey's off today. So he'll get home around 1 p.m. So we'll have a wedding party afterwards. The car looks amazing, I'm not gonna lie. I love carpool in The Sims 2. Yeah, the carpool in The Sims 2 is probably the best feature that's ever had. I love it. All right, let's get put away leftovers, please. Yeah, I'll get Jim to host the party and then I'll get Audrey to invite over the, her two elder sisters it's the best thing i can do the fact that the kitchen shelves are invisible with walls down but the stuff on them aren't is weird yeah <laughs> it's really weird isn't it it's really annoying but i really like the look of the decor of the kitchen stuff it's really nice these things are the best things i ever got in my game i'm not gonna lie <laughs> she needs to max out this logic skill so that she can get a promotion we're actually getting some money from it as well because we're doing work at home instead of just studying so yeah, I don't. I forgot that I actually put a scratch post right there, but then I also adds a scratch post as well. Oh, Cindy's gone to work, and I haven't even realised our cat is actually working. Our whole cat is working. Just imagine in real life, your cat goes off to work and pays rent. Imagine, just imagine, just 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 think about that. Think about how weird that sounds. Your cat goes to work and pays rent. Like I'm so done. <laughs> Does not sound right at all. Come on, girl, you need to finish this up because we need this promotion, we need this money, and we need to get you ready for your wedding. I don't know what kind of form wear she even has. Your cat pays the for rent and groceries, right? Like our cat's independent. <gasps> That's her formal wear. Yes, girl, she's ready for a wedding. She's ready. She's already ready. Like she's done. Okay, girl, you do you. I'm down. So where can I get such a cat? <laughs> like me <laughs> too. Hans, if you go on www.buyacat.com slash rent and there you go. I wish you could shoot longer. I would if I had time, I really do. But my schedule is so full, like you, you guys don't even know. I need to show you guys my diary because my diary is so full. Anyway, the domain is for sale. I'm weak. Well, buy the domain. <laughs> but anyway, Jim has been offered a promotion. So he now has worked from 7 a.m. to 1 p.m. Same. So you bring home 560 small days a day. So let's go ahead and take that job. I don't care. Cindy came home. What? Look at the car. Wait, whose who's carpool is that? Is that Cindy's or Jim's? Like, I don't even know. I think that's Cindy's carpool. 
That is Cindy's couple. I'm weak. Cindy come up in a whole yellow Porsche. I'm so weak. Cindy out here pimping in a Porsche. I'm so done. A whole cat. Like you're driving around a cat. I'm so done. I I'm just beyond done right now. Like I have seen too much in my lifetime. I really have. Audrey, come over here and take a shower, please. Jim needs to go to sleep. He's so tired. Okay, I'll let him sleep and then we'll have the party afterwards. When your, your cat's ride is better than yours, right? <laughs> like, come on, it's better than an Uber. Like, are you serious right now? I'm so done. I'm like, your cat is in a whole Porsche and you're here walking to work. Like, what is this? I, I ride the bus. <laughs> like, are you for real? I ride the bus and my cat is in a Porsche. Like, I'm so done. It does not make sense. Like, food is everything. Like, the amount of money I spent on food, I'll be so rich right now. <laughs> Excuse me, who's this girl? Candace? No. Bye. Okay, well, we are actually really gonna do this party. Like, I don't even care. All these leaves, I still don't have time for you. Okay, I might put a arch there. Yeah, you know what? That Those leaves were kind of cute, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm gonna keep the leaves as it is because I actually kind of low-key want them. All right, so let's go ahead and get a wedding arch going. And that will be basically the wedding stuff done. I don't think a lot of people are gonna come. So we're just gonna put like two or three chairs and let everyone else stand. Okay, that's it done. And then we need to put some lights around because it's gonna be it's probably gonna be dark by the time to do this wedding stuff so we need some light okay i think we're good i think the leaf placements are also really nice like it makes it look a lot homely like it looks like a proper four this is like a proper four wedding like this is a four wedding look at that that's so cute i like that i like that a lot that's a cute wedding people will come to this wedding if not i'm gonna i'm gonna be so angry um okay so we need some party stuff i completely forgot about them so we need this party table so everyone can grab their food I'm gonna keep it there because I have no space for it here. Like I really don't. We need somewhere people can just get drinks and just go away. So we're gonna put it outside because I don't care. And we need balloons. Where are the balloons at? There they are. If it, no, actually, you know what? It's not needed, but I want it anyway. So I'm just gonna do it. You know what, where should I put it? I'll just put it here. I think that's good. I think we're done. I'm gonna put the stereo in the hallway so people can dance to the smuttle if they want to. I know people love the smuttle. Like, like a week ago, week ago. We're tweaking hoe, tweaking hoe. Oh wait, I need to see Jim's outfit. I don't know what Jim even has for his formal wear and he can't be looking trusty in my whole wedding. Okay, you know what Jim, come over here. Find outfit, change into formal please. I wanna see what, what, what you got to offer. Please tell me you have something nice on. Please tell me Jim. Okay, Jim, are you looking fine? Okay, Jim is looking like a fine ass motherfucker. Okay. He looks good. He looks good. Whoever this is on the phone, who's calling at 6, okay, 6 p.m. is not bad. Whoever that is on the phone can rot. <laughs> How can you call in my whole house at this hour? Like, did I ask you? Let's go throw party. We're gonna throw a wedding party, please. Thank you. Everyone come to my house. All right, let's fight people that he knows. Go invite Jada, Kelsey, Laura, Renee, and Zara, because, you know, they're siblings. They're all part of the family, so yeah, that's it. We're done. So we're gonna have a wedding party and he's done his wants, which is good. So go ahead and turn that on. By the way, guys, it's gonna be choppy. Wow, everyone's here. I'm about to get crunk. Okay, let's go ahead and serve food, please. Jeez, look at my sisters. Roll up. Okay, Zara, why are you dressed as if you're going to the strip club? Whose grandma is this? Wow, she looks, she like shine bright like a gold. Like, oh, Zara, look at that. Sisters, sisters galore. This is what I'm saying. These are Audrey's sisters. Look at them. They look fine, motherfuckers. Like, they look good. Look at that. Renee looks banging. Okay, apart from the shoes, the shoes are crusty, but Renee looks like she's about to snatch everyone's man on sight. Jada looks like she is queen. Like, I rule this bitch. And Zara is like, yeah, I just came from the strip club. Literally, oh my god. And then there's Kelsey was like, yeah, this hand, this girl's hand is in, in my pussy. Like, I'm so weak. I love it. Oh, there's Laura. Laura is the alternative sister, so she doesn't care. So she's out here feeling, looking her best in a casual H&M looking dress. But yeah, this is our guest. Thank you for coming, sis. This is like a squad. This is squad. I love this. Jada looks like she's ready for business. She knows what you did last summer. So I'm going to get him to go ahead and change into formal. And then Audrey needs to get her ass up and change into formal as well. We want to get this party on the road. We want to get crunk. Okay, this house is gonna be way too small for this party. Okay, I can feel it in my soul already. How is my husband out here checking out my sister Renee? Like, yo, Jim, take several seats. Literally, take several seats elsewhere. 
And Jim is a whole player about to flirt with my sisters. I'm so weak. Audrey's ready for the wedding. Look at her. No, Audrey, Audrey, you're not reading. Not now. Let's go ahead and get married, please. Let's go get married, y'all. We're out here getting married. People move. Thank you. Goodbye. Everyone get out. This is going to be lit. I can feel him. Okay, the balloon's already deflated. All right. This is what we need. This is so cute. Come on, people. Let's get married. It's actually happening, y'all. This is happening. Audrey's finally getting married. Yes, Audrey. Bad girl. I'm here for it. Come on, people. Wait, what? If you don't go here and get married, what's wrong with you? Find a seat, Grandma. Thank you. Hola, Van. Le cuento. His whole corpse went through a fence. I'm weak. Oh, look at that. This is so beautiful. Just what you need. Just true love. That's beautiful, man. That's beautiful. She shoved that man through a fence. She loves him so much. Right? Like, oh my god. She shoved the man through a fence. She loves him that much. I'm weak, yo. Jordan ain't shit. I'm so done. Okay, so now we're done that. Let's go ahead and cut the cake, please. Wait, who took whose last name? Okay, Audrey took um, Jim's. Now her name is Audrey Pons, which is ugly. But oh well, it is what it is. I'm weak. Jim smashed that cup on his head. Who is this guy anyway? Just chilling. The cat is like, yeah, I'm the main attention here. Thank you very much. That kick is huge. Shove the whole fork into his throat. Just do it, please. I'm so weak, man. Why is Jada so rude? Uh, at least the pie is a good time, so that's all that matters, really. All right, so everyone out here in this room, getting the food and then going to eat it. Where's Jim gone? He's outside. It's also eating. Oh, look at that. A little barbecue outside as well. Oh, girl. I love it. All right, let's go do the toasts. We need to put a champagne all up in here. We're going to go ahead and toast to Audrey. Please. Thank you. Everyone go come and join, please. Thank you. Look at grandma out here with a whole bag of cookies. Like, she just, there's, there's other food you can eat, but you want to eat cookies. Like, really? And it was out here waiting for Jim. All right, people, come here and take your drink. Thank you. Audrey, look at look at Audrey in that fine white dress. That's literally me. This is my dream. When I get married, yo, I'm gonna look fine as hell. Well, that's, it depends how, how my body's gonna be looking like, you know? Laura does not care. Laura is rude as hell. Just walking out like, bye. Oh, Candice, thank you. You old hag. <laughs> oh, so cute. All right, let's go. Uh, should we dance this smuttle, please? Is everyone still in the same bathroom, like really? This is a kid. We invited a whole kid to a wedding. He and he's about to have a shower in my house. In my whole house, he's about to have a shower. Look at him. Like really? Come on, Zara, dance. The party is a good time, so we had a good party. Yes. Now everyone leave my house. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> that was fun. That was so much fun. I loved that. I actually loved that a lot. That was fun. All right, so let's go ahead and delete all this, please. We don't need any of this anymore. All right, delete all this. All right, let's go ahead and clean up all of this, please. You know what feature? This guy, stop dancing, please. Oh, the thing is not there. All right, uh, let's go ahead and use the bathroom. And you are gonna go ahead and clean up all this stuff because we don't need any of these things. You know what the feature since we had a like bachelor and bachelorette parties and generations. I've never actually played that because I never had generations, but that, that would have been so cool to have in The Sims 2. That would have been amazing. Yeah, that was fun. I loved that from least to least everything associated with the event. Leave me alone, Jordan. Leave me alone. <laughs> oh, the nan I'm trying to have sex. Wow, they're gonna have a casual sit. Okay, they just had a party gonna go ahead and christen the living room as usual. Yeah, no thing I haven't done is like I haven't booked a vacation, which means they haven't gone on honeymoon right after the wedding, which is what normally happens. Like a limo pulls up, they're like, yo, get in and they go away for a couple of days, which is always really nice to have, but I didn't organise that because I just couldn't be bothered. Are they gonna have a are they gonna have a woohoo? They're gonna have trifle <gasps> Try for baby! Yo, Jim is eager. Give me a child, yeah? You lot are mad. You are crazy people. I'm here for it. Right, how do you take a screenshot in, in the wedding for sure event? Um, I already have my recording software on. Audrey is pregnant. Pregnant? Okay, o Audrey is pregnant. Okay. And it's thunder lightning outside. Oh, hell no. Okay, that's that's something. Um, I did Basically, I have my recording software on, which is Bandicam. So it has a, a option to have screenshots only. So I put the screenshot hotkey on and I turned off the FPS 
um, little indication thing on the corner so I can take screenshots and it'll come up in my folders whilst in game. So that's what happens basically. Uh, right, there's a mod updated, there's a mod upload to this, this mod of Sims today that gives you party types for more pool party and sleepover. <gasps> link me, Jordan. Link me on, on Twitter if you can, please, or in my comments. Please. But yo, Jim wanted that uh, child ASAP Rocky, you know. So he's like, you know what? Yeah, babes, come over here, yeah? Come here real quick. We're gonna go ahead and beat. Was that fire? Oh, it was put out because of the rain. Okay, that kind of scared me just a little bit. That was real creepy, but yeah. Well, Audrey's pregnant, so let's find out how many kids she's having. Um, let me see. Pregnancy scanner. She's expected to have one child. Should I make her eat cheesecake, y'all? What, what should I do? Should I make her eat cheesecake? Can we even make cheesecake? I think we can. Hold up. Let me see. Serve dessert. No, we can't make cheesecake yet. So we may have to just deal with one child for now. Unless we get enough skills to make a cheesecake, then we can make it. But that's probably going to be a long time. But anyway, guys, I'm going to get ready for bed because I have work tomorrow. So thank you guys for coming to the stream. It really does mean a lot. Thank you all the lurkers and all the hosts. Thank you for all the mods and the bits. It means so much to me. Thank you guys for coming. I hope you had a nice day. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next stream slash video thanks for watching guys bye